Using your ePortfolio is pretty easy. It just takes a couple of steps. Once you have activated your ePortfolio, then you can copy content from wiki projects that you create in class over to the ePortfolio. And once you've done that, you can actually share this content and save it for when you are no longer in class. The thing to remember about an ePortfolio is that it is connected to when you have active classes in Haiku. So if you no longer do, then you'll need to make sure that you export these, and I will show you that in a separate video so that you can save that content. So creating the ePortfolio just requires a couple of steps. You want to create the ePortfolio by clicking here on the link and you'll see that there is a page that comes up that you can edit, you can make changes to. Right now the page is unpublished and there's no content on it. If I actually want to move content from a wiki project into my ePortfolio, I do that from my class and I'll show you that in the next video. To be able to share this content, I can click Share ePortfolio and from here I can either send an email to someone if I know their email address or I can actually just grab the link and I can copy and paste this link anywhere that I want to be able to share this information so that people that don't have access to our school system can still see the content. It's great to be able to share with grandmas or family, other family relatives, other friends um, that you would like to be able to show the work that you've been doing. So either email or link. I would not recommend using the share to other websites because this would require a connection to those websites like Facebook, things like that, and we don't actually connect Haiku with them. So I, grabbing the link or sending the email is going to be your best bet for sharing that content.